Coming into the 2021 disc golf season, I had no idea what to expect. I was super nervous coming into my second ever disc golf pro tour event at Waco. And actually I was able to shoot a super hot round and I was able to make the lead card after the first round. That was a huge moment in my disc golf career, just showing myself that I'm, I'm here and I belong and I can do it again. Other moments that I think of are at the Clash of the Canyons. I fell two strokes short of winning this event, had some unfortunate things happen towards the middle of the round on the final round. Even getting fourth place at a Silver Series event, only losing by a couple strokes. That felt really good and uh, overall my game was really solid at that point. A couple weeks later I played at the Preserve Championships and played three really good rounds played solid in the wind and the conditions and was able to get myself a solo fourth place finish on the Disc Golf Pro Tour Elite Series level. That really showed that even on the Elite stage, not just the Silver Series, that I can play with the best and I just have to fix a few things to be at that level every single event. Ever since I started playing Disc Golf, Prodigy has always been my favorite brand. Will Schustrick has always been my favorite player. And uh, that kind of just naturally drew me towards wanting to be on Team Prodigy and being with Team Prodigy for another two years is super exciting for me. My main goal for 2022 is to grab a win on the Disc Golf Pro Tour. That could be any one of the events. Something that really excites me for being on Prodigy for the next couple years is just continuing to be with the Prodigy family. I've been with them since 2017. It's been amazing the whole way. Another thing is growing my brand through Prodigy and growing myself as a player. I think that with Prodigy, I can get to my maximum potential and uh, you know possibly become one of the top five players in the world.